guys, so today I am going to be doing a haul video and there's pretty much no makeup. There's only one makeup item in this haul and I mentioned in my last video that I gave up buying makeup for Lent. So this doesn't count because I bought it before Lent and um, it took a while to come in. So I will just start off by showing you the one makeup thing and then just get into it. So I don't know if you guys have heard this or um, saw other people do the haul with this, but Hot Look or Outlook, I don't know how to say it, and I'm not trying to say that I know how to say it, but um, that website was having a sale on Urban Decay, so I decided to pick up the Book of Shadows. I think this is number four, and it has some really, really pretty colors, so I'll show you guys what they look like. Um, really nice. I think kind of um, has some like more springy colors. I really love the blues and the purples and of course the neutrals So I'm excited to try those out and it also comes with a curling mascara um, a primer potion. I believe it's in um, Sin and it also has a full-size liquid liner. So that's awesome So I wanted to show you guys that I'll put the link for Outlook or Hot Look, whatever you want to call it um, down below in case you don't know what it is, but I'm sure you probably do if you watch any YouTube videos so next I'm going to get into um, some stuff I got from Bath & Body Works. I just got a few things. So the first thing I got was one of these little car portable scent things. And I already took the thing off and I just forgot to put it in my car but I wanted to show it in this video. And this one's in Tropical Spice and it smells so good. It's one of their new, um, they have a bunch of like tropical scents in there right now. So yeah, because you can smell it. But this is what it looks like. I think it's so cute. It's kind of like cheetah slash flower print so it'll look cute my car is white and black interior so you know have a nice little pop of pink in there that smells so good and then i got the most adorable little candles ever and i believe they were two for five yeah so i got four mini candles for ten dollars and they're so adorable so i got four different ones i got tiki beach like how cute are these little mini candles so i got tiki beach um, coconut leaves, sea spray, which I love like ocean kind of clean scents like that. And then the last one I got was peach bellini. And this is probably my favorite. I like the way this one smells um, the best, but I don't know if I really want my house to really smell like this, but it smells so good. Mmm, I wish you guys could smell these, but aren't these like so adorable? And you can get four of them for $10. So, you know, you can test out the scents and see which one you like the best before you go and get the bigger ones, which I believe are on sale for 2 for 20 right now. Okay, so next is this necklace I'm wearing. Um, I got this from Etsy, and the designer, or like the seller, is Lily Lawson. And I thought it was really cute. Um, Jennifer Lopez, Kali Ripa, and I think Kourtney Kardashian are just a few of the celebrities that have been seen wearing one of these. And I really like it. My friend's... Sabrina here on YouTube. She has a similar one. Hers is, I think it's just a plain. I don't think it has, it's like this one is, I don't know if you can see, but it has like diamond, not diamond. You can get a diamond, but I got cubic zirconia because you know, um, I didn't know if I was even really going to like the necklace on me. So uh, I don't know, maybe in a few months I'll splurge and get the real one, but I'm not really sure. But mine is the off-centered one, so you can wear it, you know, off-centered, but you can also wear it centered too. So it's all, it all depends on what you like, but it's really cute. It's so tiny, and I like how it's really delicate it is, and it just is just like a little splash of bling in there. It's not something huge and gaudy looking. So next I got these adorable flats from Target, and they were only $15. So um, I figured I'll need some new shoes just to wear for spring, and they will go with everything. They're nude flats, and they look like this. And I just think they're so cute. I love nude shoes. Like, I love nude pumps. But let's be real. I don't wear pumps on the daily just because that's just not me. I'm not a... I don't wear heels all the time. So these are what these look like. I think they're so cute. And I actually had to go up to a size 8. Usually I'm a size 7. Sometimes a 6.5, sometimes a 7.5. But these, I don't know, flats tend to fit me differently. And um, I just wanted to get... Um, nice and comfy one. So these are in a size 8 and like $15 from Target. And then I got some clothes from Express. You guys know that I love Express. It's my favorite store. And I had a coupon 
Um, I believe it was 75 off 250. So if you spend $250 and you get 75 off, and I had like a $25 gift card, so I ended only ended up spending like I don't even know. Okay. So at least I'm spending like one fifty. Um, so yeah, I got um just like a bunch of shirts. So I will show you, and I like you guys know I like to wear colors. I don't, I either wear bright colors or black, pretty much. So that's what I usually wear. So the first shirt that I got, um, this one was twenty nine ninety, and it is kind of like a bigger shirt, but it doesn't make you look bulky or weird. But it has like lace, like cutouts. So right down the front, it really it looks like it's like on your shoulders, but it goes right down your side. So it's really cute. And this is like my favorite color, if you guys didn't know that already. Um, and they have this in a bunch of colors, so I might actually go back and get it in a different... I think they have purple, um, a navy blue, and then black and white, I believe. So really love that. The next shirt I got, I actually got this in two colors. And it's just kind of a... I mean, these really look like nothing um, until you put them on, but I love this color. It's so bright and springy. It actually reminds me of the Nicki Minaj lipstick. Um, so it's a really nice bright pink, and it's like um, banded at the bottom. So it's not going to be like huge and loose and make you look like your Prego or whatever. Um, and I also got it in the green color, and I probably will end up wearing this on St. Patrick's day but I love green also so this is what this one looks like I love green it makes my eyes look more green when I wear green um, so yeah these were $29.90 and um, what was I gonna say oh everything I got from Express is an extra small that's just what I get so if you're my size or you're wondering what to get if you don't have one near you on order line. That's why I say my size. I don't say extra small because like, oh my god, I'm so skinny. Like, I'm so skinny. No, that's not it at all. So don't think that. Don't think that. Um, next is, uh, it's kind of like a t-shirt, but oh my god, this is so cute. And I just picture wearing this with like a super dark tan when I'm tan in the summer. And oh my god, I just love it. Um, just with like jean shorts, like ripped ones, you know, you know. Um, so this is what it looks like, and it has bright pink flowers, and it also has, um, I don't know if you can really see, but it has like that burnout pattern, and it's cheetah, like a cheetah print, and it's so cute. Oh my god, I just love it, and I love white in um, like summertime, and I love that it has like a tropical feel to it. Uh, I'm just like obsessed with it. I think it's so adorable. So I cannot wait, to, I cannot wait to wear these things. Like right now, we just keep getting more and more snow the first two days of March, and it's just ridiculous. Ridiculous. Um, next is actually a floral print shirt. And I pretty much never wear floral print. But this shirt looks really cute on. And I picture wearing this with like white um, skinny jeans. Or like white shorts I think would be really cute. Um, so this is what it looks like. And I know these all look so ginormous. But I promise you, you're not going to look like huge. Um, so this is what it looks like, and it is, like, that smocked thing at the bottom, so it's, like, it'll be, like, tight to your waist, and then it has, um, like, an open v-neck with little braided, um, tassel thingies, so it's really cute. I wish you guys could see these on, but unfortunately, I probably won't be wearing these for a while since it is so cold right now, but, you know, whatever. Um, only two more things. This is just another top, um... It is obviously like a uh, animal print and really cute. The girl in the store was wearing this and I was like, oh my god, that looks so cute on you. So I decided to pick it up and I think everything I got was $29.90 to be honest with you. Like all these things are $29.90. And I just got them so they should all be in store or on the website if you are interested. And the last one thing I got was... Um, I mainly got this because the color of it is just so gorgeous. The two colors are, like, so pretty together. And it just looks like this. It's kind of sheer. And I don't know what the print is. I, I kind of want to say it's, like, zebra almost. But it's really cute. Has, like, the openness in the front with, like, little tassels. And it is banded at the bottom. So, again, it's not going to 
be like huge on you. So that's what I got from Express. And the last thing I'm going to show you guys is two bikinis that I got from Victoria's Secret. So I just got two. I have been actually really good this year. I, last year, if you watch my haul from like January, February, um, I bought a bunch of bathing suits. But this year, I've been good. I've only bought two so far. But they keep sending those freaking catalogs in the mail. And I'm just like, I need all of these. So this is the top to one. So cute. I love it's hot pink and then it has like the jewel um, detail in the middle and it also has an optional strap. Um, but obviously when you lay out, you're going to wear it strapless. And oh my god, I cannot wait to just be laying out and being awesome in that. And this is the bottom. And it is really cute. It's like tropical floral print. Um, bright pink and kind of like corally colors and greens and then the sides are cheetah kind of reminds me of that shirt I got from Express actually it's so cute and I get them in a small I get my top and a bottom in a small um, I need to lose about like five to ten pounds though before I want to put those on um, and then I just got this one I think is from the very sexy collection or whatever um, and it is my favorite color looks like this it's actually called um, I think it's in Turks and Caicos, or the color is something Hawaiian, not Hawaiian, tropical like that, but oh my god, I love the color, and it's like one of those push-up tops, so it has underwire, so it's going to give you a little support, and make your girls look pretty and up and cute, <laughs> so that's what that looks like, oh my god, I'm just obsessed with this, I need to go on vacation, I want to go on vacation so badly, uh one can dream right and then I got the matching bottom which you know is just the same same color and everything and I don't know I just have so many bikinis and it's just like something I like to collect like oh, one more thing I forgot I got this I don't think this is classified as makeup this is a hair care product so don't be preaching to me that you're buying makeup because hair stuff and nail stuff I don't feel like that's makeup I don't know. Let me know what you think. But I also got this Suave Professionals Keratin Infusion Dry Shampoo. And I sprayed it in my hair before this video because it was looking a little, you know, limpy, dimpy, and not so much greasy. But just it was feeling a little bit under the weather. Probably because it is snowing out and it ruined my hair. But it smells so good and it doesn't leave any kind of white residue. So, well, that is a big issue for me. If you're a brunette, if you have dark hair, and you've ever tried a, sh a dry shampoo that made your hair look white and, like, you have gray roots, like, that's not cute, get this. It smells so good, and, um, I think it helps if you have greases. I don't get super greasy, so I don't know. But, yeah, that's the last thing. Oh, and I got this at Rite Aid. I think it was, like, $4, maybe. But, yeah, so that's everything I got. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will talk to you soon. Bye! Did you guys notice anything different about my eyebrows? I got my eyebrows started for the first time, and I'm so nervous. Um, I tweeted, like, is it painful? Like, is this going to be making me cry? Am I going to be embarrassed laying there in the middle of the mall, like, crying while this girl's doing my brows? And, oh my god, they look so different. I don't know if you guys are going to, like, notice or, like, comment on it, but I think I like these. And it didn't hurt. It didn't hurt. Plucking hurts way worse. Waxing... Um, I don't mind waxing so much, but I hate the redness, and I, it always makes me break out. Not break out, but it gives me, I don't know if they're ingrown hairs or what, but, um, this I really like, so. I'm just showing you guys up close and personable. Uh, I don't even have them filled in or anything, so, I don't know, it made my eyebrows feel like they were thicker, but she took away hair at the same time. So you usually have to fill them in a lot, but they're actually pretty dark. I don't know what she did to them, but the girl hooked me up. She hooked me up. I beat it, beat it up, 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 up. She hooked me up, 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 up. Oh, okay. Game over.